focus online. Others are expecting better sales in more traditional settings, including Freddie Stolmack. He is president of Weatherproof. He has his own strategies he's going to be sharing with us. Freddie, great to see you again. Great to see you. We too. shop at the same grocery store, we should say, on the Upper West Side of Manhattan. We can't mention the, uh, another grocery store, but Fairway, I'm in there a lot. Fair addicted to Fairway. Fairway. All right, let's talk, first of all, about how you made it in the news since the last time we saw it. You had President, President Obama happened to be wearing one of your coats. Yes. You saw it. You were, you were clever enough to spot that he was wearing one of your coats. You put it on a huge billboard in Manhattan. And what happened then? Uh, well, uh, first thing we did was we spotted the jacket uh, on the cover of the Wall Street Journal. We bought the photo from Associated Press. So you did it all legitimately? All legitimately. And um, we uh, had offered it to the New York Times, Wall Street Journal, I think the New York Post. And it was a little bit too dicey for them, and we decided to put it on a billboard. And we had a billboard in Times Square, which we owned, and we put the um, jacket up with the picture of the president walking the Great Wall of China. And um, predictably, we heard uh, maybe about a week later from Washington. The White House wasn't all that enthusiastic they about having the president advertising a product. Not as excited as we were. <laughs> <laughs> but having said that, I just want to move this story along. Sure. This really helped sales. Well, it turned out today that th this is the biggest selling jacket at retail in the United States. So it tells you that branding is key. Branding, branding is still key for totally, selling products, totally. right? And I think that's the part of, a good part of the secret of the success of Weatherproof. We've been fortunate in taking a contrarian viewpoint and um, doing some things that are a little bit offbeat. A couple of years ago, the two-second uh, Super Bowl commercial. Um, uh, things like that that uh, are a little bit unexpected. Has that changed, though? I mean, our, our tastes and the way in which we get information about uh, what feeds our taste from the Internet, for example, is changing every day. How mm -hmm. do you keep up with all that? Well, I personally don't. My, I've morphed really into marketing and to PR, but we have, we've doubled our staff. And, uh, so you're have, hiring, too? Oh, like crazy. Like crazy. Our business has never been better. Um, I think it's uh, partly due to our entrepreneurial nature. I think it's partly, partly due to the David Pizer organization, which is really entrepreneurial. Is it also due to the fact that the economy is turning around right now? I think the economy is turning around, and I think it's going to be a great Christmas. I think it's going to be a great holiday. I think it's going to be a great Thanksgiving. For all lines, for the upper end and the lower end? I think and for the, in the upper middle? end and the lower end, but I think the, a big part of the secret of our product is its price-value relationship. So it's not necessarily cheap, and it's not expensive, but it's excellent value. And I think consumers today are probably more sophisticated than they've ever been and are able to spot that price-value relationship. Now, Patrick Byrne, of course, is, is focusing on the Internet, but you're also dealing with the traditional stores. We're dealing with the traditional stores. So we, there is uh, room for both. There's room for both. Our, our, our account list goes anywhere from top to bottom and in the middle. All right, Freddie, stay with us. Freddie, are you up on all these things? I'm up on some of them. I'm up on some of them, and I'm still so enamored with product and so enamored yes. with distribution of product. That's my main focus. And product is still the bottom line, isn't it? I mean, people can see the, the incredible thing about information now is you can get it from so many different areas that mm -hmm. if you have any product defect, mm -hmm. the information about that gets out real fast, doesn't right. it? Right. If I was to say the most important thing when I went into the industry it was sales and we had to have a great salesman today number one is the brand number two is the product and they're very very closely related Freddie Stolmack weatherproof is the product if you're lucky enough to get the president clacking <laughs> for your product right. you're, you're I just want to I just want to jump Please. in on one thing with Quick. the uh, with this jacket and that is President Obama in no way endorsed that jacket he no in no way uh, advertised the jacket I understand but you caught wearing him it. wearing it we caught him wearing it up on the billboard <laughs> and that billboard lives in our memories forever <laughs> Freddie thank you very much thank you